Hey Cynical Militia, Professor Cynical back again with another No Man's Sky glitch video. Now guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can do the very best salvage data duplication glitch currently in No Man's Sky. If there's anything that you still need to get, especially after the new update that still costs a lot of salvage data, this is going to be the video for you. So let's get right into it. So the very first thing you're going to do, guys, is look for a buried technology module. Make sure that your scanner is on analyst mode, and then you want to mark it. Now, once you're at the location, guys, use the terrain manipulator and bury deep until you get to the actual technology module. Now, you'll get roughly anywhere between two and five salvage data. Fantastic. So, for example, this one, I got three salvage data. So, what we're going to do now, guys, is we're going to make our way up to the anomaly. So, once we're in the anomaly, guys, what we're going to do is we're just going to get a landing spot here, land, and then jump out. So, for this next bit, we're going to be using the personal refiner. Now, we're going to go ahead and use the ever-famous personal refiner duplication glitch for the very starting points here. So, we're going to go into the personal refiner. And then we're going to go ahead and select our salvage data from the menu. Don't just drag it in. Once you've gone ahead and done that, you're going to jump in and out of your ship. That's going to create a save point. Now, you need to then go back into your personal refiner and pull that salvage data back into your exo suit. Once you've done that, find a random person in the anomaly and give them over an item. It doesn't matter what item, just send it over to them. Once you've done that, make sure it says sent, and then you're going to go ahead and reload your raw or save. So we're just about back into the world here. Fantastic. So if we go back to our exosuit, you can see the one that we pulled out. And then if we go into our personal refiner, you can see the one that is now duplicated. Perfect. So what we're going to go ahead and do, guys, is we're going to duplicate about four stacks of them. So I've gone ahead, guys, off camera for two, three minutes, and I've just gone ahead and duplicated using the personal refiner duplication glitch, and I've got a nice few salvage data now. However, whilst this is a perfect way to get four or five quick and easy stacks, it's not perfect for mass duplication, which if you want to buy any of the new items from the shop, you are going to need hundreds of salvage data to purchase all these new items and materials. So for that, guys, we need to go back down to the planet. Now, guys, just while we are doing that, I just want to quickly grab your attention. So for those who have followed my channel now for a little while, knows that my PC is unfortunately kicking the boot. It's in dire need of repair and upgrading. However, guys, as we know, with the current climate the way it is, PC components, unfortunately, aren't as cheap as it once was. So to help me cover the cost of the repair and upgrade to the PC, I've gone ahead and started a small fundraiser. We're trying to raise 700 pounds. Currently, we are at 150 pounds raised. It lasts for 30 days. It's a 30 day campaign. So if you want to go ahead, and help me out today, you can find more information by clicking on the link in the video description down below. And if you do decide to go down that route today, I want to say a massive thank you in advance. And also thank you to everybody who has currently donated as well. Alright guys, so the very next thing we're going to be doing here is selecting an exocraft. It can be any exocraft that you want. However, I have space in my Nautilon today. And yes, I have a Nautilon on the ground. Don't question it. Don't worry about it. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump into our exocraft so it makes it switch to the right one. Then we're going to go ahead and put in our salvage data. And then we're going to go ahead and run back to the ship. Once we're in the ship, guys, we're going to go ahead and jump in and jump out. That's going to create a save point, which is absolutely vital for this stage. So make sure you get that save point in. Then all we're going to do is go back to the exocraft menu and we're going to pull back those salvage data. Just put them in to your normal exosuit. And once you've gone ahead and done that, this is where the next vital stage is for this glitch to work beautifully. So we're going to jump in our ship, but this time we're going to fly off into space. Do not, for the love of Jeebus, do not jump out of your ship. If you do, you're going to have to restart the whole glitch again for this part anyway. All we're going to do, guys, is go off into space, and that's the only thing you need to worry about at this point, and then call in the anomaly if you haven't. If you have, fly to it. So as we're flying into the anomaly, we're going to get an item ready to transfer. It can be, again, any item that you want. It doesn't particularly matter too much. All you need to do is get the item ready and transfer it over to a player when they become available and able to transfer 
transfer it over and then reload your raw or save but again guys make sure make sure it says sent and if you land by chance and no one's available to give an item over to don't get out of your ship just take back off and do the same thing again go out of the anomaly and then come back in rinse and repeat until you get somebody but usually you will get it first try so here we go guys we are now back in the game and if we go over to the exosuit now there we go so as you can see i've got all the salvage data as you would expect and if we go over now to the nautilon get into the proximity range i think the nautilon's drunk again but here we go go over to the exo craft and boom so you can go ahead now and do this as many times as you want like i said the person with final duplication glitch use that to get you started on the first few decent stacks saves you having to go and find them out in the wild and then mass duplicate them with those awesome exo craft honestly i love this glitch so much let me know what you think about it in the comment section below also guys if you are new around here we are trying to hit 50,000 subscribers by christmas day it would be amazing for the channel amazing for the glitching community so if you are new around here guys make sure that you're smashing that subscribe button and if you all enjoyed today's video make sure you leave a like before you leave today as well all right guys well that's everything from me here today and as always my name is professor cynical and i'll catch you all again in the next one bye for now thank you every single one of you for watching today's video now do me a favor smash that like button if you enjoyed it if you are new around here subscribe to the channel i release videos like this all the time if you're feeling extra generous today you can go ahead and head over to my patreon page link in the video description anything that gets contributed to the channel guys goes back into the channel it's a massive help so if you do decide to go down that route today i want to say a massive thank you also if you have some extra time today don't forget check out some more videos i'll have some popped up here on the right hand side for your viewing pleasure right anyways i'm off to go and hunt some australians and eat some crayola